Let's take a look at the final tally for 2014 Say Detroit Radiothon, and let's pray and hope that we made Whatever our mark. Bump. It is 803745 Wow. And I'm happy to say that we actually ended up with more than the tally there, because by the time some late stuff came in and a few days later was added up, it was actually in excess of $820,000, $825,000 all of which we will be dedicating today to different groups, all of whom do a great load of good. Real Life My Music and Lena Purnell, this is the second year that we've been able to uh, fund her. I think last year we were able to give her $10,000 and we're adding $5,000 onto this or $15,000 that we've invested. So Lena, please come up and accept your check. We want to uh, give $7,500 to Erica Wright and the Westside Cultural Athletic Club. Continue my journey. <laughs> I'd like to call upon Tyrone Chapman to receive the check, please. We want to present a check for thirty thousand dollars to Cass Community Social <laughs> Services and Faith Fowler. As Mitch said, uh, created in partnership with the City of Detroit and Matthew Stafford's Charitable Foundation, the Say Detroit Play Center is an innovative academics, sports, and music arts program. We're not, we're not stinting, are we? No. <laughs> <laughs> that will open this year at the former Lipke Park Recreation Center. The program will require students to maintain a certain grade point average and school attendance to use the athletic facilities and will provide academic tutoring on site. So with that, I'd like to invite uh, Mike Tenbush up to accept a check for $327,500. Wow. Thank you. That concludes our handout. We're out of money. Uh, but we will be doing this again because we are going to do the Radiothon again on December 10th. So thank you. God bless you all. Really appreciate you coming out. Thank you.